Hey family, so this video is going to be about a dream I had two days ago that the Lord gave me and he told me to share it. He literally said, share this prophetic dream because it's going to help people see that this world is spiritual. Everything is spiritual. It does not matter. Every single thing, everything you hear is spiritual. Everything you see is spiritual. Everything you feel is spiritual. Everything is spiritual. Everything that happens to you is spiritual. So y'all in this dream as you can see by the title it's about my ex so if you don't know i'm gonna put the videos down to like what happened with my ex and that whole hot mess that's what it was that whole hot mess but basically the lord was telling me how when we broke up he started giving me dreams about her cheating on me so she was cheating on me the whole time we were together and i didn't know this I thought she was loyal. I thought she was faithful. That was main, That was like one of the main reasons I was with her, right? And so she was cheating on me the whole time. The Lord told me like every time she would leave, she was cheating every single time. And so not only that, she was real toxic. She was just, um, it was just bad, all right? I'm gonna just put it like that. He gave me a dream and this is what it was. So I remember I was getting ready for work and I was like, and she was there. I'm getting ready for work. I'm like, oh my goodness, I'm gonna be late. I'm gonna be late. I looked at the clock, it was nine o'clock and I have to be to work by 8.30. And so I was like, oh my goodness, I'm gonna be late. And then um, she was like, it's all right, I'm gonna drive you, I'm gonna drive you. And I was like, no, it's like, no, you don't understand. Like I have to be to work at 8.30. And I was like, um, what happened? Oh, she was like, I can't pay my bills though. So it's like, she wanted to, she was like, I could drive you to work. She was like, but I can't pay my bills. And I was like, I'll pay your bills. I'm good. Like I'm getting good money right now. So I could pay your bills. And I was like, and I, I got jobs lined up. So it don't even matter. Like, like I was at first I was panicking about being late. And I was like, you know what? I got jobs lined up. I got jobs hitting me up, calling me out of nowhere. It just happened sporadically, whatever. I could pay your bills. And so when I woke up from the dream, y'all, I heard my ex say in the spirit, I'm getting fired. Y'all, I know y'all like, what? Like, what are you like? What are you trying to say? Y'all, money is spiritual. Poverty is spiritual. Jobs is spiritual. That's why when people was laughing, talking about all oh, this and all that, when I told them about the Lord talking to me about the spirit of poverty, they didn't understand that it has nothing to do with what you think, y'all. It is a spirit. It is a spirit that is attacking. So while you're sitting here judging somebody because of their situation, it is a spiritual attack. So how can you judge a demon? You literally can't. It's either you're going to rebuke it or you're going to receive it. And so the Lord told me that since she was such a cheater, He's going to make every single female break her heart that she gets with. And not only that, I'm just finding this out the other day, is that he's going to make sure that she is low, like at a low place before she goes. Because y'all know about a video that I made before. She's about to die. She's about to die. But, um, who shall? The whole point is that now she has that spirit now she's getting fired and i remember i was like what is she doing to get fired like is she not showing up is this is that he's like no it's spiritual i am not going to let her um get like she's not gonna be good let's just put it like that she's not gonna be good she's not gonna be good like he wants her to suffer because of how she was with me so the point i'm making is this is all spiritual everything is spiritual and when people treat you wrong you just don't get back don't do nothing because the things that god can do is crazy like people don't understand when he said vengeance is mine it's deeper than oh just be nice and you know let people do this no it's because god really moves like when you really rocking with him he will move he will move in a whole different way that you cannot do like you can only do but so much what can you do the Lord is like, all right, so I'm going to make it. Like, this is a curse that she has right now. This is a curse. She has a curse on her life. She's never going to find love. She's not going to be rich like she thinks because that's her dream, to be rich. 
And, you know, I'm going to just add this in here too. Since I'm already on the topic, the Lord told me that she was using me that whole entire time. Because she knew I was going to make it. That's how she felt. Her and, and her family. Not just her. Because I remember, yo, this is crazy. This is crazy. I didn't know that they saw all that in me because how they were talking. But this is really the truth. So, her family did not like me at all. Like, they did not like me. And I'm like, if they don't like me, why they always inviting me places? And you know what I mean? Like, I mean... Y'all, when I tell you, they used to do some stuff for me. And I already knew something was off. I did. Because I'm like, y'all don't even like me. Why y'all always doing that? The Lord told me they all knew I was going to make it. They all knew. Now, they thought it was going to be for secular music. I thought it was, too. I thought it was going to be the worldly music. But God switched that up. Anyway, the point is, they were all using me. They thought, oh, she's going to pop off and this is going to happen and that's going to happen. And we just going to, you know what I'm saying, put her to the side and da, 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 da. They thought. They thought. And I'm going to just put this in here too. I had an outer body experience when I fasted. Y'all, fasting is so powerful. If you want something crazy to happen spiritually, fast. Just fast. But anyway, I fasted and he gave me this outer body experience. And I remember I said... I want you to take me to I want you to take me to see Raina that was the first thing I want you to take me to Raina's house <laughs> y'all don't ask me why I don't know why I really don't but I was like I want you to show me what's going on with Raina and he was like no and I was like why no I didn't say why I said so take me to um Imani's mom's house because you know what this is what it was i wanted to see if their relationship progressed because it was like i'm gonna be honest with y'all it was the worst mother-daughter relationship i've ever seen like i've seen some on tv that's real crazy but no that was some real life like crazy stuff so i was like i wonder look at me all pure and stuff i wonder if they patched up their relationship like if anything progressed so i was like take me to go see my ex's aunt i mean my ex's mom I was like, take me to go see my ex's mom. And then he was like, I can't show you Raina and I can't show you um, your ex's mom because I would have to take you to hell. Like I would have to show you them in hell. So that was his way of saying that they're gonna be in hell. So yeah, that's that. Um, mm -mm -mm. Yo, this is crazy. This world is crazy. Um, and by the way, if y'all want me to interpret y'all dreams, hit me up. Like, my email is in my description. Y'all, hit me up. I'll tell you your dreams. I'll tell you the meaning of it. Um, you know, people be out here charging people for dreams and stuff like that. Like, really? Mm -mm, they need to get their whole life. But y'all could send me y'all dreams and stuff like that. I'm going to interpret it. Because I really care. Like, I really care about the kingdom. I really care about what's about to happen. I care about this move that's about to happen. And so, yeah, that's that.